Right. We got Cornell, Steven Moshe, also Nigeria. Um, didn't qualify for the finals. Sounds like you had some massive throws out there, but there were fouls. Take us through the competition. Uh, my first, well, my first two throws really. My left side was just going way too fast. I, I was a little excited, and then the third throw came, and like my coach was basically like, I have one throw to make finals. Or, like, I mean, and, and, like she was like, oh, I'm so proud of you. So, like, I got one more throw. So I was like, you know, I'm gonna go for it, and like, no matter what. So I went for it, and it ended up playing out. Like, I, it was like probably one of the be couple best throws I've had, or close to it. And it would have been like an auto qualifier, which not even many people, like Olympic champions, only in the auto qualifier. And uh, after landing, I ended up taking like a peek at it just at the last second and fouled a little bit. I mean, it was kind of nice because, like, after I threw that throw, like, every other throw, we just like, wow, like, this kid's the real deal. Like, he's going to be a real throw. And, like, all of them were like, oh, my God, you're only 20. Like, come next year, you're going to be winning this and all this. And all of them were saying this to me. And I was like, I mean, it's a nice experience. All the other. But, uh, yeah, I wish I, I hit that last throw. <laughs> so we're number two in NCAA right now. You think you can get that throw down next week? Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, I, I, we start really late with training because we want to be the peak outdoor season, which I think I'm going to have much bigger throws out there. But, uh, like, in doing so, like, my technique is not solid and I'm, like, very consistent. But uh, I, it's getting more consistent by the week, honestly. And, like, the fact that I can pull that out even here, like, I mean, it was, like... And so, like, I think, I'm, I think I'll be really good for next week, probably. Talk a little bit about the decision to compete for Nigeria. I mean, you threw for the U.S. with juniors. Um, I mean, how did that come about? And if you're going to be one of the top throwers in the world, it sounds like in a few years, do you think maybe you should have stayed with American? Are there more sponsorships? Or I always wonder that. I mean, I... Like I, I made the decision to go to Cornell because like track is not something I, I, I like trying to get money out of per se. Like I mean like I'm doing it for the experiences and the fun and honestly I, like go, competing for Nigeria is going to open me up to a whole bunch of new experiences. I mean competing for America the Diamond League meets and all the things like that. But competing for Nigeria have things like African Championship, Commonwealth Games, like these amazing meets that like realistically if you're an American thrower you don't have the opportunity to go to. And also, I mean, being from my home country and just being able to go there and train there sometimes would be nice because, I mean, I don't, I'm not a richest person. I just can't randomly buy a flight to Nigeria and go visit there. So, I mean, it just opens up a lot of opportunities. And also, like, I get to throw a big meets like this. Like, I mean, there's not as much competition in Nigeria as in the U.S. where, like, you have to PR in order to make it every time. So. And well, I guess one last question. I mean, last week at the Ivy League Championships, smashed the meet record, beat you know gold medalist Adam Nelson's you know Ivy best. Sort of, does that make you think, wow, you know, I could be an Olympic medalist? Like, when did you start thinking on that big? Um, I don't know. I'm not sure if I'm exactly thinking that big. I'm just kind of like really like taking it one day at a time and like yeah I mean if I go to a track meet like no one should go to a track meet with the minds of them that I'm losing I always think I'm going to win and if I'm allowed like go to the Olympics I'm going to think I'm going to win there too I mean yeah it's a great competition and, but I think if I'm on my A game and everything perfect and my training goes well like I think I can be straight up there with them so alright we'll catch up with you next week in series good luck thank you